Welcome to the Ammunition Archive, and this is the 762 by 38 millimeter R Nagant. You can see here it is a rim cartridge. So you get the head stamp there. But you see it looks like the bullet, the projectile, is pushed into the casing. If you look here, there's a little bit of a lip here. Now this round was produced in 1895 and it was designed to be used in the M1895 Nagant revolver. Some specifications on this cartridge has a bullet diameter of 7.82 millimeter or 308 inch, has a neck diameter of 7.26 millimeter or 0.286 of an inch, has a case length of 38.86 millimeter or 1.53 inch. Now the overall length is the same because of how this cartridge is designed. Has a rim diameter of 9.855 millimeter or 0.388 of an inch. And it has a base diameter of 8.94 millimeter or 0.352 of an inch. With a 108 grain projectile, it has a velocity of 1,000 feet per second, producing 239 foot-pounds of energy. Now, here it is beside a 223, a 38 Special, a 45 Auto, and a 9mm Luger. Now, one neat thing about this cartridge because of the way it's designed and the velocity that it runs at is also the design of the revolver itself. So you can see here, this little gap, when the trigger is pulled, the cylinder is pushed ahead and this gap will actually disappear. And this part of the cartridge here will seal into the forcing cone, allowing it to actually be suppressed. One of very few revolvers that can actually be suppressed. This cartridge was also used in some experimental submachine guns, but they never saw any use. If you enjoyed this video, then please hit that like and subscribe button, and have a great day.